How to wipe NVMe and M.2 drives. There are several methods, including resetting the PC, disk management, and Windows setup. Let's try first reset PC method. Open Windows settings and search for reset. Click on reset this PC. Then select get started at the top. Choose remove everything. Followed by local reinstall. In additional settings, you can adjust options like clean data, which removes files quickly but is less secure. Download Windows, which reinstalls Windows from your device. And delete files from all drives, which removes files only from the Windows drive. Click Confirm. Then Next, and let the process complete, it may take some time. Now, let's try the second method using disk management. Press Windows plus R on your keyboard. Type diskmgmt.msc in the run window, and click OK. In the disk management window, select your NVMe or M.2 drive. Then right-click on the partition and choose Format. Set the file system to FAT32 or XFAT. Then uncheck Perform a quick format. Click OK. And a warning message will appear, stating that all data will be permanently deleted. Then click OK to proceed. The process will take some time to complete. These methods work but are slow, and the data can still be recovered with recovery software. To ensure complete and secure data erasure, you can use SysTools data wipe software. You can find the download link in the description. Once downloaded, simply install the software on your system. This is the interface of SysTools data wipe software. Select the drive option. There are also options for pen drive and files and folders. But since this video focuses on NVMe and M.2 drive, we'll choose the drive option. Now select the NVMe and M.2 drive you want to erase permanently. Once selected, click on Next button to proceed further. Next, choose a data wipe method. Methods with fewer passes are faster but less secure, while higher pass methods provide better security but take more time. For a balanced approach, we'll use NATO standard 7 passes. Finally, click Wipe to start the process. A warning message will appear, stating that all data will be permanently deleted. Now click Yes to proceed. And that's it. That's how you can wipe NVMe and M.2 data using different methods.